Ve bazı izleyicilere merhabalar. Bugün Çırağan Sarayı'nda bir basın toplantısındayız. Netflix'in CEO'su ve kurucusu İstanbul'da Türkiye'ye geldi. Ve 3-4 ay kadar önce Türkiye'de de yayına başlayan Netflix'in Türkiye'deki gelecek planlarını paylaştı. Biz de kendisiyle röportaj yapma, söyleşi yapma şansını yakaladık. Really tastings. Uh, welcome to Turkey first of all. Welcome to Istanbul. It's really nice to see you here. You're uh, one of the most famous people in today's internet world, in internet history. Just 20 years ago. I, I would like to start with, with a very short story of Netflix. It's 20 years ago. You came up with the idea of Netflix uh, in a world in, in, in the states where the, the connection the speed of uh, the connection is around one or one half megabit, megabit per second. And how had it appeared to you that it's going to be a big success? Twenty years ago, uh, we started Netflix, um, but at first it was just DVDs by mail by post. Yeah. And then in 2007, nine years ago, we started with streaming. And mm -hmm. now we're so excited to be launching here in Turkey, finally, yeah. uh, with our great shows, with Stranger Things, with Narcos, um, House of Cards, all of our good shows. And is 2016, why? Um, why okay, Turkey had uh, fast internet connections for the last, I don't know, 10 years, which is uh, not bad uh, to make Netflix function properly here in the Turkish market. Why have you went till 2016? I know it's taken us a long time to mm -hmm. get here, but we're, we're really happy now to get all the service right, to have mm -hmm. uh, great subtitling, great shows. It just takes a lot of money for us to buy all the rights and to invest. Mm -hmm. And so now we're, we're happy. And Netflix, it's very inexpensive here. It's only 15.99 lira, yeah. so less than the cost of a movie ticket. Um, it's easy to try. Anyone can try it for free. So we hope uh, lots of people here in Turkey will, will try Netflix. Uh, you're operating in many countries. Uh, you uh, open up to the world uh, suddenly last year, starting That's from right. last year, to around 190 countries so That's far. Right. Uh, uh, how uh, uh, the content, uh, how do you... Uh, what was the, uh, the content of the content that you're sharing in across this uh, 190? Uh, the, can I see Canadian shows, for example, or Brazilian shows in Turkey? Or will I be able we're, to? We're now producing shows all over the world. So we've got a, a show in Spain, Cable Girls, that's getting developed. We've got a show in the UK, The mm. Crown, about Queen Elizabeth that's coming. We've got Narcos, which is produced in Bogota, Colombia. Mm -hmm. So again, shows all over the world. And what we have uh, here in Turkey is our all of our global shows, plus some great local shows that we've licensed from local providers. Mm -hmm. And it's just so easy just to try Netflix and see the great content we have. And the streaming, it's very well developed. So mm -hmm. even over uh, a DSL internet, it looks great. Mm -hmm. oh, you have your original productions for the uh, last couple of years. Oh, House of Cards is one of the most famous ones. Um, do you have any plans uh, to uh, to make uh, some Turkish productions? Uh, I don't know. You, you don't have an office in Istanbul. You have an office in Amsterdam. But still, do you have any plans to produce t a Turkish series or films? Absolutely. We want to produce uh, great local content here and mm -hmm. also content that we'll make available mm -hmm. around the world. Um, so mm -hmm. looking for great stories uh, here in Turkey. Okay, so then uh, you're planning also to export Turkish-made uh, movies uh, abroad. Yeah, there's a long history, as you know, of Turkish content being popular uh, in the Middle East, uh, in Eastern Europe, and around the world. And so we're also buying content for the rest of the world. Okay, uh, our, uh, that, that part of our audience who are interested in production uh, movies and series, mm. where should they apply for uh -huh. um, through the agents uh, is the the best way. Agents, uh, which which we uh, we'll work with all all of the agents. Uh, okay, the, uh, in those geographies in Eastern Europe, in Turkey, one of the major problems, uh, headaches, actually, I should say, uh, against uh, the production industry is uh, film production is, is the piracy. Uh, do you have any schemes uh, to tackle this issue in Turkey, for example? Because it's it's really big. Yeah, no, piracy is big around the world and big in other countries. And what we do is we have a great service that's very inexpensive. As I mentioned, only 15.99 lira. 
and the streaming is great, much better than piracy. There's no viruses, there's no advertisements, so it's a much better experience than piracy. Mm -hmm. And what we found is people use piracy to get shows they want, um, not because it's free. And they're willing to pay a, a fair fee, a small fee, um, mm -hmm. to be able to get great shows with um, no uh, viruses. Uh, okay, uh, what will be the, your next Netflix, Netflix next big step in Turkey and uh, the markets similar to Turkish? Well, this is a big step for us today in, in launching where we're now priced in Lira, where we've got a subtitling and dubbing on the shows. We've got great kids content. We've got some great series and then we've got our original series. Um, mm -hmm. And the next big steps are when we're doing local shows. Apart from piracy, pirates, I should say, who are your competitors? in the world and in Turkey? Who sure. do you think? Well, our main competitor is sleep um, because, <laughs> um, you know, when our shows are great, uh, yeah. you just stay up late at night and you sleep less. Um, so we really compete against all forms of relaxation. Okay, oh, uh, I'm sure that you're not, you cannot share some figures, uh, projections. So, uh, what do you hope in the Turkish market? Well, what we hope and what we've seen in other markets is for us to be able to grow to one third of Turkish households, really? becoming uh, a Netflix member. Uh, it usually mm -hmm. takes five or seven years. Mm -hmm. uh, do you have plans to open an office here anytime soon? No, or just yeah, we watch first. Based out of Amsterdam, uh, and that's where we do the the European marketing. Okay, uh, that was all. Great. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Thank you. For us. Thank you.